Uh, Bad Intentions Boxing, delighted to be joined by Ebony Jones, who made her debut tonight at the Wembley SS Arena. Ebony, how are you keeping? Yeah, I'm good, yeah. How did you find that? Three years out, first time back? Yeah, it's mad. Obviously, three years, I'm thinking about three years out of the ring. I think, what the hell did I do at that time? But I'm so glad to be back and where I belong. Um, also, in front of all my friends and family. I've never had that before, where I've in front of so many of them. Uh, it's been good. You've been out there tonight, you know, you definitely put on a performance. A lot of people are giving you rape plaudits from that. It, is that a style that we're going to see moving forward, or, or is there going to be a bit of an adaptability changing? Yeah, I forward? think you're going to see that style moving forward. going to see better than that. It's just, I feel like there was a little bit of ring rust there, but um, it was always that was always going to be the way it was. I'm happy to get the win. I, I think, as you say, you know, it was quite well publicised in a lot of interviews that you've done yeah. recently. You know, you felt like actually you was in quite a bad place. You know, you. you was, I think, uh, well, it's been, the... This time last year, I would never imagined I was having my debut in Wembley Arena for many more. It's mad how much things to change it in a year. Then putting me on the main, main fight cards, like just before the main fight, it's just mad. Yeah. Is there anyone that you look up to or anyone that you potentially like to emulate in women's boxing? Um, I love Mike Tyson. <laughs> That's what I love. Uh, women's boxing, no, I think I'm different. I like to think I'm different uh, than other females. Obviously, I. Respect, I'm inspired by Katie Taylor, and um, she paved the way. But like style-wise, I think I'm just on my own person. You, you definitely look like you brought your own style in there, and somebody yeah. who likes to have a scrap. I yeah. think that's the fairest way of saying it. Yeah. Do you think there's that element of the transition that we'll see over from the amateur to the professional game, and actually about blending those skills and taking that from adapting it to the professional game? Yeah, definitely. Um, like my trainer, Johnny Edwards, he, he's so good for our style. He just complements it, and we're working on all the head movement, and it just it's just relaxed, but not not too relaxed. It just works well, and it's just developing our style all the time. Are you at the stage where you've got a career map planned out, or, or somewhere that you'd like to get to, or is it literally graph by graph, day by day? Oh, obviously, I wouldn't be doing it if I didn't think I'd win the world title one day. That's what we do. That's the end goal, but um, they, I'm in no rush to get there and just enjoying it along the way. Like, the past week has been amazing. I, could, I never could imagine it would be like this. Ebony, listen, it's been great talking to you. You deserve all the glory you've got. Congratulations on your win tonight.